Hey guys, Dexter here from uh, Dexter's Workshop. Uh, I've received a lot of questions about uh, Qt um, programming, uh, PyQt5 and uh, Python and also some questions regarding how to show temperature uh, on a Raspberry Pi LCD. So I've decided to make a small application that is based uh, on PIQT5 and Python. It's running on a 7 inch LCD with a touch screen. Um, and it's reading temperature from a DHT11 sensor, which is a very cheap uh, sensor. And also, I would not use that type of sensor in a production environment, but for um, I don't know, for didactical purposes, for learning, it's more than enough. So basically what this application is doing is reading temperature and humidity from the sensor and then it di display it on the LCD. Uh, what I've decided to do is uh, those two labels will turn the color in red if a non-valid acquisition from the sensor was made and also those two labels uh, will change their colors um, based on some values that are read from a configuration file so basically you can change the thresholds for the alarm those two will turn red and those two will also turn red in case of uh, um, acquisition uh, uh, in case of the acquisition it's uh, not valid as you can see there are some errors because this particular sensor uh, needs uh, quite some uh, perfect timing to achieve that and the uh, raspberry pi is not quite able from time to time to do that. Um, this is just a learning application, so I also uh, used the button, uh, added a button here that will stop the acquisition and will turn uh, both labels in a yellow background and you can also start the acquisition and we will start the acquisition again. All this uh, is made using threads so um, the uh, G GY thread and uh, the acquisition thread are running separately. You will get all the source code that uh, was uh, written for this application. Uh, I will also post uh, my Git page and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thank you for watching this. This is Dexter from uh, Dexter's Workshop. Bye-bye, guys.